Welcome all you Plus Two Comedy Modifiers back to the Thursday show. Welcome to Plus Two Comedy Extra. And it is now 2019. I'm, February 2019. I mean, I'm like a month late on this video. But I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys about what Plus Two Comedy will be doing in 2019. Plus Two Comedy at its core is still a comedy group and we still plan to be touring the country doing anime, video game, and comic book conventions doing stand-up comedy. We're also going to be bringing back all of our usual panels such as uh, Beyond the Tentacle. Currently our Beyond the Tentacle is called Fit to be Hentied, uh, but we are as always, working on the next version of that one for Otakon, as we always do. We also, as always, do Making Your Nerd Dream Job a Reality. We just That's where we just sit down and talk to you guys. We now do a writer's workshop panel. If you want to be a comedian, we'll sit down with you and we'll tell you the structure for your jokes, how to get on stage, how to get over stage fright, how to make your jokes a little bit more funny, and how to make sure the comedy club doesn't hate you. We also have our brand new game shows. We have been doing Game the Gamer for a while now, and uh, we've really crisped that up, so I'm real happy how that's going. More updates about that one coming. We also have our new game show, Geek Out, which I think we're going to change the title of. But it's one of my new favorite panels where you could be crowned the biggest geek of a convention. You just need to know your nerd trivia and be able to debate like a champ, because nothing is nerdier than winning an argument. We also have a few brand new panels coming out. That includes Walt Disney's America, a look at how Walt Disney and the Walt Disney Company presents the idea of America. We also have Stay Doomed Live, the live version of our podcast, Stay Doomed. We love bad entertainment, or entertainment that's underappreciated. So at this panel, we'll be explaining why some shows just seem to evaporate into the mist. What makes a one-season wonder? Why do pilots get picked up and not picked up? Find out at Stay Doomed Live. And our next convention is ZenkaiCon in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. That's going to be March 22nd through the 25th. There we will be doing stand-up comedy. We will be doing Beyond the Tentacle, Fit to be Hentied. We will be doing Walt Disney's America. And we will be doing Stay Doomed Live. So please come on out and see us at ZenkaiCon in Lancaster in March. Now, on to some uh, sadder news. Uh, will Liam will not be there at uh, ZenkaiCon. Uh, will has come to the decision uh, that he's going to step away from Plus Two Comedy. And it's okay to be sad about it. I'm really sad about it. I'm going to miss touring with Will. Uh, but we're just both in very different places in our lives. And this seemed to be the best option uh, for for him. So you could be sad. I'm sad. Uh, don't yell at us <laughs> is, is my, my one uh, request. But uh, I do want to take some time and just thank Will for uh, all he's done for Plus Two Comedy. Uh, we've toured all over the country, um, mo mostly the East Coast, but we did get on an airplane more than once. Uh, so we shared a lot of great times, and uh, you know, I I'm sure he'll be popping his head in every now and then when it comes to Plus Two Comedy. So that does mean that Plus Two Comedy is now made up of myself and Laura Prince, and we'll be touring around and bringing the funny. And we also now have the opportunity to have more guest spots. Uh, so I know a lot of people out there will ask me about Alex Perlman. They ask me about Vegas. They ask me about Nick Fury. They ask me about TJ. They ask me about Joe Doc. All these people that we've toured with before, and now we'll probably be touring with again. So if there's someone you'd like to see, you know, I can drag good old Uncle Yo out of retirement if you want, and send him on the road with us, uh, let us know. Because we, you know, we still want to make you laugh. So let us know what you'd like to see out of us. Getting back to it now, Laura and I are still working on the Stay Doomed podcast. The Stay Doomed podcast now takes up the spot of the Plus Two Comedy podcast over on Podbean, Stitcher, iTunes, all that good stuff. And it's a podcast where Laura and I watch a show that ran one season or less and 
basically decide whether or not it deserved another season or if it should stay doomed. We've done reality shows in the past. We've done adult animation. We've done a spoopy month. And now, even though I just said it's a show about television, we're doing the Razzie movies. So be sure to check out the Stay Doomed podcast. The links are below. So now let's talk about what's going on with YouTube. Right now, you are watching this video on Plus Two Comedy's YouTube page. The current schedule is as follows. On Monday, you will see a brand new version of the Stay Doomed podcast. So if you don't want to watch it, or if you don't want to listen to it on iTunes or Stitcher, if you need it right there in your YouTube description box, it's right there for you. And give a listen to the Stay Doomed podcast. Then every Thursday will be Plus Two Comedy Extra. That was something that I was playing around with in 2018, just having random shows and just, you know, popping in every now and then. But now I'm committed to it coming out weekly. We have a bunch of different ideas for shows, and if any of those catch fire, maybe they'll just get their own day. But right now we're basically throwing out some pilots, and you're going to decide if they deserve a full season or if they should just stay tuned. Then... Coming in March, we're hoping to have out the Plus Two Comedy Podcast Remix. Basically, right now, all 258 episodes of the Plus Two Comedy Podcast are available on Podbean, iTunes, Stitcher. But only a few of them are, are available here on YouTube. And I want to backpile all those wonderful episodes that we've had. Our journey from... Jester's Playhouse to Gamer's Vault should all be on YouTube. So I'm going to be re-uploading old episodes of the Plus Two Comedy Podcast on Friday starting in March. Now, they're old episodes, so I understand. It's like, ah, I want something new. Well, they'll get a brand new intro every single week where I will explain a little bit about it. And when possible... At the end, there will be a little bonus interview where we'll talk about what happened on that episode and how we've changed. I mean, the first episode of the Plus Two Comedy Podcast was about five years ago at this point. So I'd like to archive that, and it's good to check in and see how these people are doing half a decade later. But that's not the only YouTube channel we have. I want you to check out Plus Two Comedy Gaming, the home of Game the Gamer. Eventually. Right now, Game the Gamer is currently completely filmed. It's just being edited, and the editing process is taking much, 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 much longer than I had hoped. But we're really going to nail down, and hopefully we're going to get this out very soon. Uh, I'm, I've seen a couple of the episodes, and they look great. I'm very happy with how they're coming out. Uh, but more updates on how they're actually going to be scheduled to come out are coming very, very soon. Also, if you are a Kickstarter backer, expect very soon for you to be getting those rewards, emails about those rewards. I know I love, owe a lot of people t-shirts and stickers. Those are all going to be coming out and information about those things very soon. I have not forgotten. But in the meantime, there is a lot of content over at Plus Two Comedy Gaming. Every Monday, you can watch me play God of War. Yes, I've been playing God of War for a very, very long time, and it's getting, like, no views. But I need to record it, or I'll never finish the game. But if you want to check out the adventures of Kratos and Atreus, every Monday, that drops over at Plus Two Comedy Gaming. On top of that, on Tuesday, it's the Not Prawn Riddle, where I try to solve the hardest riddle on the internet using nothing but my mind, a yellow notebook, and your help in the comments below. So be sure to check out my live streams of me trying to solve the world's hardest riddle every Tuesday on Plus Two Comedy Gaming. Can you solve it? Let me know, because I'm really bad at it. Uh, Wednesday was another God of War, but now... Kingdom Hearts 3 is out, guys. I'm not sure if you've checked it out, but I also made a video explaining everything you need to know before you play Kingdom Hearts 3. Make a little thing pop up. Uh, you can check that out as well. But I'm super excited for Kingdom Hearts 3. So starting on Wednesday, there will be a brand new episode of a Kingdom Hearts 3 Let's Play. It's dropping every Wednesday. So 
Go on that heartfelt journey with me. I, I tend to cry when I play that game. So go on a heartfelt journey with me and check out Kingdom Hearts. That brings us to Thursday. Thursday I play very hard games. Right now I am nearing the end of Hue, which is a very colorful uh, platform puzzle game. It's excellent. I'm having a great time with it. Uh, but that will be ending soon. I'm nearing the end of that game, which means I'm going to go in the complete opposite direction. Instead of the calm, cooling colors of Hue, it's going to be the white knuckle flex game of Fury. Fury is a fantastic game. It is a fighting game. It is a, a, a boss rush game. It's something really beautiful to behold and i'm not wonderful at it but it was such a good time to play so be sure to check that out very soon on plus two comedy gaming and then on friday it's multiplayer friday where i upload my multiplayer games i'm about to end my backlog of friday the 13th which means i will be switching to fortnite because when i filmed them i was like fortnite's the thing so you're gonna watch like I don't know, three or four seasons ago when I was playing Fortnite. It'll be a good time. And then I'm switching over to Dead, Dead, Death by Daylight? I'd be switching over to Dead by Daylight on Fridays. And uh, I'm not great at scary games, so watch me cry. That brings us to, to March, actually. Because starting in March on Sundays, there's going to be a brand new show called The Flash Game Paradox. As you might know, starting in 2020, Flash will stop working, and we might lose all these beautiful Flash games that I've grown up on and loved. So Laura Prince and I dive deep into the internet and nominate games that should be preserved in the Flash Museum and should not fade away when Flash is destroyed. So. Come and join us as we play Flash games on Sunday, starting in March. Then, starting in April, we are going to have the education of Laura Prince. Laura is a gamer, but she's mostly a handheld gamer. She was more of a Game Boy player. So she's missed out on a lot of console games. So, I've taken upon myself to educate Laura on all the greats. We're going to play all the games on the NES Classic. We're going to play all the games on the SNES. If I can get my stream to finally freaking work for my Switch, I'm going to teach her how to play Smash. So it'll be a journey for Lara Prince to figure out all the things that she's missed in the world of console gaming. And that's not all. Starting in April, I'm also going to be starting a third YouTube channel. Check out Plus Two Wrestling, where I will put all that wrestling content that you guys don't really care about here on this channel and put it over there for you to watch. So be sure to subscribe to Plus Two Wrestling. That's going to start in April right after WrestleMania because I don't have enough on my plate yet. And speaking of wrestling, let's talk about Cosplay Pro Wrestling. Cosplay Pro Wrestling will be at Zenkai Con March 22nd through the 24th, so be sure to check out Cosplay Pro Wrestling. It is all your favorite Smash Brother anime and video game characters duking it out inside of a wrestling ring. And I'm happy to announce that I've finally gotten around to do some editing. And those videos are going up on the Cosplay Pro Wrestling channel every Friday, hopefully. Very soon, maybe even tomorrow. I don't actually own that channel, someone else does, so I make the videos and send them over there. It's supposed to go up Friday, hopefully it will. But I'm working on them, and there's actually going to be content on that channel. So head back over to Cosplay Pro Wrestling and check out some of your favorite superstars, you know, like me. Every year around this time, we do a tournament over in Facebook world. So head on over to our Facebook page and you can vote to find a new champion. See, we found the greatest fighter. We found the greatest duo. We found the greatest army. Now it's time to find the strangest bedfellows. These are teams of two that I've matched up almost randomly because they have similar names. So, will they work together as a team in battling another team that may not work very well together? The choice is yours. Make your voice heard and vote every day on new tournaments 
over on the Plus Two Comedy Facebook page. So we got a lot going on, and I almost forgot about Twitch. I Twitch every weekday at 4 o'clock, and you're going to notice a very similar schedule to the YouTube schedule. But So those are all the ways you can see us. You can see us at ZenkaiCon. You can check out this here channel. You can subscribe to it so you can get your Plus Two Comedy Extra, your Stay Doomed podcast, and the Plus Two Comedy Podcast Remix. You can also check us out on Twitch where I stream all my games live. If you can't be there live, check them out on Plus Two Comedy Gaming where all my live streams go, plus the new shows, the Educational Law Prince coming in April, and the Flash Game Paradox coming in March. Also check out Plus Two Wrestling, which I'm very excited to get to work on, over on the other YouTube page. And, of course, Game the Gamer stuff, I haven't forgotten. You'll get your reward soon. So thank you for bearing with us. Thank you for checking out Plus Two Comedy. We're very excited going into 2019. And we'll see you all very soon. Probably at ZenGaiCon. So we'll see you then. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Boop.